Hello everybody, my name is Kyrus Edwars and welcome back to Final Fantasy 16. Now, the last three episodes, I'm... I'm shocked. <laughs> I'm, I, I, I'm still shocked the fact that we took down the greatest fucking fight in the whole game. Sorry for swearing a bit early in the video. Well, too early in the video because normally YouTube will probably think... <laughs> poopy. And all that because I swear. But anyway, besides the point... We got to the, the the area that we we had to get to Drake's Fang, and the funniest thing was that we thought it was going to be like oh we had to go away um, on the top of that um, Drake's Fang where that big over crater was, but um, no, it was basically more undergroundish, and we learned a couple. I've learned a couple of things about. Um, about the guy, the, that he's skinny guy, the one that picked up Hugo, which just without a problem. He even called me Mythos and even King Barbus. Speaking of which, about King Barbus, we are on the we are on the point now. We're going to be fighting him, which I am terrified because I just we I I just kept realizing the fact that that's going to be he's going to turn into Odin, and Odin is like one of his um. Uh, icons that that I remember a long time ago in Final Fantasy VIII that he he once you get once you require him Odin he's basically just a, he will, will appear at any time right at any time and he will instantly one hit anything you touch so for example you got caught a bunch of encounters wild encounters guess what he comes in without you without you requiring to summon him he will just come out boom one hit on it so and it's sometimes it's like that with bosses depending on the level on the boss as well because sometimes you can basically one hit him and then done however in 10 if i remember it was a different guy altogether that you have to pay kill pay a lot of get a gill for him wait so for example the higher the amount you do it the higher the chances you can try and one hit Sid or Sin sorry or anything else in the go but <coughs> going back to the, the three episodes so our uncle joined up with us we've we had a little bit of a laugh with him when we met up with a douchey guy which I kind of thought he okay he's cool and then we got to Hugo Hugo got like tr crazy imagining things imagine imagining things that the fact that he saw a detector but naked oh la la but I'm glad most of it being censored out and the mere fact that there was a naked version of me turning into E3 and betting her in the neck like a weird type of vampire kind of style and then the full fight begins with the first route for the first phase and then next minute he became so much more like the titan lost by eating a chunk of crystal, a big, like a big chunk of crystal and then the epic song came in and I was like oh boy <laughs> I was like losing my mind and we basically it was like Sonic Going so fast, dodging everything, like debris, walks, whatever it was, he was tossing. Even he was tossing, like he was bringing out hen hentai technical walk things, and I was like, "Oh, come on!" But that whole fight made me happy, and I'm still saying this now that this game is game of the year. It has to be right. So after defeating him, we. We had a little um, interaction to see what Dion, uh, e e Dion or whatever, you, I can't pronounce his name, the prince guy from the Emperor. He, we found out that he has he has a different type of way of relationship, so that was kind of happy. I'm happy for him, and he got a letter coming through saying that his younger brother is now reclaimed to become emperor. And he wasn't happy about that. And Joshua came in, thinking he owned the place. I don't know why he's doing this. 
he must have his own agenda, his own goal or something. I really wish that we, he just tagged along with us. And now we're with the lovely mate, lovely mid, because we are trying to get her to stop working and join me as Crave to go to Sid's grave. And she's working on a big giant ship. Sorry to keep you waiting, mid. But you'll be pleased to know that work on the shield. And I'm still on the verge of trying to find the best legendary weapon with sword. In a manner of speaking. Hippocrates knew of a substance that's highly resistant to heat. Oh, boy. Heating that should provide the protection you need. He's supervising the construction and testing of the shielding as we speak. And also we spent a lot of time with Tarja. I knew you wouldn't let me down. So, that was okay. nice. I'm just the errand boy. <laughs> right oh. then. Better start working out how to bolt all these bits together. To the Black Hammer! Okay, right, okay. And I, I just want to point this out there. Um, my uploads now are going... I don't know what's going on with my, in, my internet connection. I don't yeah, know, about, I don't know why. My LAN cable keeps popping up saying connected. Um, bleeding, bleeding I had like a little bleeding. issue or two with the uploads. And the uploads are now saying it, it will pop... Every time when I upload like three videos... And it doesn't matter because usually it doesn't really matter because every time I upload three or two videos, it's usually like it's like 40 minutes, maybe at least 50, right? And that's brilliant. Or usually 20 minutes. Or maybe 26 minutes. Okay. But now they're popping up saying it's two hours in 40, which is literally pissing me off. So I don't know why. Um, it's doing that. Maybe it's the probably the wind. The, the my internet's just gone to shit. Um, thank you again for that. Sometime later, but I tried everything. I tried like moving my router. That didn't even work. I even tried to restart my router from the other, last night, and it's been literally pissing me off. So, ah, <sighs> so it's going to be a. I can't really do much now, but I'm going to try. Uh, Got videos set it's up from finished. the PC, my Steam, from Epic Battle Simulator. I haven't that. uploaded them because I was kind of worried the fact that because how long it took for these three, the last three videos Black I did there, because I thought I had to do another two. But it looks like I just done three. I'm so sorry. I'm kind of happy. Oh, didn't I tell you? The Enterprise has four Mithril engines, and we'll be needing a displacement stack for each. You don't mean. <laughs> Don't worry. Now they've got a finished one to work off. My gang in Canva can build the rest. Good luck to them, I say. Right, I'm off to get a sling for this elbow. Any other work comes in, keep it to yourselves, eh? Hey. Are we done? Hey, right, come on, mid. Let's go see your daddy. What's the matter? Nothing. Just daydreaming. Thinking about the Enterprise sailing off over the horizon to shores unknown. Searching for a land untouched by the blight. Just like me and my dad planned. So if the worst came to the worst and every scrap of soil in the twins turned black, we might still have a chance. That's what she was meant to be. You see, one last chance just in case we needed it. But now she's so close to being finished, I've realized I don't want her to be that. I don't want her to be just a lifeboat for us to cling to if things get desperate. I want... I want people to sail aboard her by choice, not from the lack of it. In a world where we're not just trying to survive, but where we can actually live. I'm working on that. And I'll do everything I can to get you what you want. <laughs> Don't you always? No. All right. My mind's made up. As soon as the Enterprise is fit to sail, I'm putting her under your command. Sod our plans. I'm trusting in yours. Oh, God. Are you sure about this? Something tells me it's what my dad would have wanted. He'd be proud of you. You, um... You were going to visit his grave, weren't you? I was. 
And you can come too, now that your little project is finished. Right. There's just one thing I need to finish up first. Won't be a mo. All right. I'll let Otto know you're coming. Meet us in the mess when you're ready. Aye, aye, Captain. God. Oh, God. We're going to... Are we going to try and control this big behemoth? Because we, when you give me options like that, it's going to be... Available quest to be... You are fucking kidding me. Early off the bat? Alright. <sighs> Alright, so there's something new... Wait, what the fuck? State of the realm... Marshall reports, Peter. Oh yeah, the stone hang. Weeding table. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to go back and do the weeding table. Fuck me. Ah, uh, God, there's so much shit. And also, there's a fucking side quest right there, which is a plus. So that means it's going to be a part. Or can I wait? A part of type. Okay, right. Um, before I talk to Otto, then I need to go and quickly go up here because I'll, before, when I'm coming back this way, I need to check something. Because I want to check that border, because I want to confirm at the text stuff. Okay, so it's below me. I'm not an actual dwarf, I'm just racing that song. It's kind of cool. Well, that's it then. Reckon you might be just the man to help me out with a bit of bother, if you've a mind to. Let's hear it. Well, it's about this alembic the chief's got me making. Lovely bit of kit it is. Bung the solution you want split in, and it'll. But honestly, God, that Titan like fight that. was so good. Is, so good, and now, and again, we are going to be playing. We, we're never going to think King Barbus. Can Barbus? Uh, Barbus or whatever his name is. Can't even see his name. Right. Um. We'll be cooking off, and that's where I was hoping you could help me out. So it's going to be a little bit chaotic, but. And again, I still don't know about the points things, the, the points things with the side when you complete a side quest. I really do I not know. I could get some use out of this Olympic too, distilling medicines and the like. All right, why not? Proper job. So, what exactly do you need for this filter? Nothing but bomb ash will do, says the chief. Gave me a sample she'd obtained from the university stores. Couldn't believe my eyes. You pour the blackest blight water through it, and it comes out clear as a mountain stream. And of course, I do. Sir, I checked the I thing on PlayStation. Um, at who long? Apparently, they have a deal here, name? and it's, it's called Episode. So Episode One. And <coughs> I'm kind of worried to me going in. back to play that game because I know that game drives me insane. If you wouldn't mind, I, I, I saw a billet on the hunt board for one <sighs> the other day. Would have gone myself, but well, fighting dirty great balls of flame isn't exactly my forte. Oh, oh it's in the, the board. Hand. Oh, fuck. Right. I'll see what I can do. <coughs> good hunt. Oh, good I, hunting, eh? I, I knew it. I, I knew I need to check. Well, you know, it's, you, know, you know, it's funny. I have to check the boards because I did say I was going to fucking wait. God damn it. Okay, use the boat, use the hunt board. To, oh shit, for the bomb king. Oh, it's an actual. Oh, alright. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh great. Great.
Are you on the board? Are you on the hunt for a bomb king, Kapu? If so, I have a bullet that it might be might interest you. Oh god! And I can see it right at the fucking bottom. B. Clock. No, uh, clock. It's a bar. It's a clock. Ah, balls. And it's a B. Because the one right beside it is an S, and I need to find out if it's that thing. Because again, I did beat when I was at the desert earlier. Um, I fought with him in the video. And to tell you the truth, that was actually a good fight, but he did whoop my ass. And there is a few others as well. Wait, that, 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 well, sorry, a group of them. And then I have this thing, the hill to die on, and then I have muddy mudder, and then I have this thing, which I'm pretty much going to end up losing my mind with, because again, I am going to be like going back and forth, and I will do like a special episode for that, to try and take them out, and I have a funny feeling if I don't do them all, it's going to be more stress because each time I level up, right, and, wait, I need to type in Bomb King um, on YouTube. Uh, my level right now is only 33, and I'm close to level up again, and I have a shit ton of points, so I think it's time for me to increase the gauge. Because I'm tempted to get, I want to get like an extra bit of power in me, if you know what I mean. Like for example, I want to get this thing, and I want to increase this uh, the frames of rebirth because this thing is actually quite handy to have, and I want to get the tornado. That way, I can like just strain their health a bit by bit by bit. So, I think I'm gonna get that. Um, I want to get... What's this one? Aye, I wanna get that, too. Aye, we'll get that. We'll get that. Ooh, that's gonna be... Wait, okay, I'm gonna keep it to there. I'm gonna switch this out. Switch these two out from the other ones. And I want to use, uh, and I got two thousand points because I want to like cause a lot of mayhem. If you know what I mean. Wait, I want to do a lot of destruction, and if my fucking land cable stops popping, sorry for raging, but it's been annoying me so far. Wait, literally annoy me. We'll increase you. Um. <coughs> oh, no, no, no. Where, where, where are the ones is here? Precision, precision dodge. Because th there is a, like, a lot of good shit I can use too, because I want to like... Yeah, we're, we're buying this. Yeah, we're buying this. I want... I think I just... Oh god, I just I'm not upgraded it. Date me guys. Oops. Okay. <coughs> so, we'll... I want to keep... What's this one? I... Uh... I'm gonna switch you and get a worst. That's I'm definitely keeping you. You're staying. Uh, I'm gonna switch that because I love the machine gun punch. I'm calling it, 
and then I'm gonna get the big one. Yeah. So that means that will be a nasty, nasty combo. Very hard, right? And I'm gonna live from that. So, okay. I'm gonna pause. I'm gonna pause the recording real quick. Um, and I'm also going to before I do that. I'm gonna before I pause the recording. I'm going to check one thing, and I'm hoping my dear lovely Karen has new weapons because I need it. Well, shit. It better all be here. No, not yet. Finished, right, that you? that's fine. That, that that'll be fine. And I, and I saw a goose. Um, I need you to do something for me. I want you to check this fucking weapon I got. Not bad. If I do say so myself. Hold on. Can you do it again? Oh, you can. Because the funny thing is, I want to keep this sword and I, I, I don't want to like sell it because I like this. I like the, the detail on this weapon, so that's why I want to keep it. But we are going to max this bad boy out. It lasts you a good while. you got to be. Hold Anything on. Else? Let me see this weapon. It should be fine, I think. I don't know why I speak high pitched, wait, like pitched voice there, because I'm kind of worried. <laughs> Let me see the detail on it. Ah, it's got a nice cup. Right, okay. So, um, we are. How. Actually, how's my health? Items. Ah, we're good. Right, anyway, I'll be right back and I'm going to. Figure out where this bomb king is. Alright, sorry about that. Um, I'm just wait following up the path because normally I would do this on my own, but I want to make sure I got rid of that quest because that means that it will save me time. It will save me a hell of time for this so. Right, where are you? Okay, so you're... Wait a minute. The fuck? Bomb King... Wait a minute, am I sh being stupid? Yeah, I'm at the dragon's knit bay. Oh, fuck. I didn't... W oh, okay, 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 okay. So, if I'm like... Right, it's behind that little... Sliver. So, if I need, I need to wait, like, find it. I see it right in the right in the bottom of this thing. Well, now I know that move. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Um. That that's kind of funny. Oh, hey, God. That, that, that's funny. Right, you, you got to admit that was kind of funny. I just didn't realize that was going to ag. Is it going to ag on other ones? Right. 
There we go. Okay. So, right here is where the bomb is. Right? Now, all I need to do is I'm just going to pop it right there. Because now, we're in a new area. Um, so now I know where this little piece of shit is going to be like. I know for a fact he's going to be pretty a torture. Because remember, I did die once by one of those hunts. By one of those monsters. And... To tell you the truth... I am a bit wary about this because we are going directly where... Um, where this thing is and I'm probably end up gonna die a lot so and it's funny I never really expected this type of creature will be in, in this area because normally it will be like in a cave or a, an, a, an actual inside tomb but no but there he is He may look like a skull, but we're going to take him out. Right. Do this. And he's literally kicking my ass. And he summoned people to save his tape. Oh, oh, oh. Do the pop pop. He's more partying. What a bitch. What the fuck? What the f That's all my That's all my health. No, no! I'm not dying again. Oh my god! We were both at the same level as well. Oh. Bomb Amber. Oh, great. Thank you. Your reign is over. Now to collect the ash. This looks like the stuff. Let's see if there's any more. I am shocked. That thing just would not stop. That should do it. For not way angry. Place. That was like pretty much close on. I spammed that shit. Wait, just concentrate. Just spamming it. Why the hell he was in here anyway? Okay, like let's just go back. Ah. Oh. Oh god.
No, he should be fine, right? He should, he should be all right without needing all this stuff, and he couldn't ask for more. If he even asks me, Nick told me she was building a ship. If he's really wanting to ask me to get more shit and do another hunt, I'll take it. That means that'll be another one out the road because I won't have to worry. I wouldn't even have to care, but. Yeah, that hunt was a bit of a torture. I can give it I can give it credit though for pretty me low health, but I'm gonna to have to well since now I got ten K I'll probably end up able to buy more of them at least. Alright there, Sid. How's that hunt for the bomb ash going? I have it here. Yeah, just take it before I sell <laughs> That's the stuff. And plenty of it too. Enough to keep the Olympic going <sighs> for a good old while. You're a gent, Sid. Let nothing say otherwise. Right then, let's get this contraption up and running. Yeah, and I bet you're gonna create another bomb by blowing it all up. Waiting for it. Sometime later. I'm on the limbic. And it works <coughs> just like the chief said it would. <sighs> Very impressive. <laughs> Says the man who cut down a burning boulder. Speaking of which, I still haven't returned a favor. There's no need. The good it will do for the hideaway is reward enough. Mm -hmm. Don't be silly. Well, obviously, I'm still going to get rewarded for this. Yours. The one you keep your potions in. <laughs> <coughs> we could work some magic on that, huh? What kind of magic? Well, we happen to have isolated a substance in our test run of the Alembic that I reckon will make even the toughest lever supple as anything. Thought we might use it to breathe new life into old boots and the like. Save the hideaway a few, Gil. Ah, I reckon if we slap a bit on your bag, it'll loosen it up enough. For you to squeeze in a bottle or two more. Well, it can't hurt to try, I suppose. That's the spirit. Leave it with me. I'll only be a mo. We're gonna have to look for more stuff. Well, what do you reckon? It certainly feels more. Of Flexible. Right? Told you. Thank you. I think. <clears throat> no, no. Thank you. No, no. no. Fuck you. you. I mean, thank you. Without you, Sorry. we'd never have been able to discover wonders like that stuff I rubbed on your back. I'm telling you, there's plenty more where that comes <sighs> from. Quest complete. Good. Hey, I get more XP. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, okay. So we got a uh, new shit. Oh, capacity. Fuck yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I inventory increase. Thank you. Oh. Glad I did this quest. Now, let's see. Um, potions up to six, high potions four, uh, strength and other and stone and tonics will be free free. Okay, good, good, thank you. That is a lifesaver. Thank you very much. I needed space. I was kind of worried that the fact that, wait, do I need inventory space? But I didn't know you can get it. I didn't know you could do something like that, so... That's another thing I need to keep in mind then. Okay. Um, the only thing I am confused of is the, is the... Every time you complete a side quest, you get like it's points like for it. And I have like a lot of points and I need to figure out where to sit, spend them. Um, before this uh, let's play ends, because I am kind of curious about the whole thing. 
Okay. Go on, then. So that means I will go to here and pop, 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 pop. It's better I'll be here. And I forgot You're to spend another blind, one. You know. I right, get four lows. Cannot find a better price than that. It better I'll get be that. Here. Oh, we just need one Cannot of them. Find a better price than that. And there we Come go. Again. We are oh, levered and we're ready and we're pocket. Anyway. Right. Um. Right. No. Go back to see. Uh oh. Take take the lovely mid out. And the time we get to Sid's grave, we should be fine. There should be no enemies. If there is, I will walk stone them to death. All right, Clive. Astrid. We'd finish sending half the hideaway train. And we kind of over, we kind of spent a little bit more on the tornado, so I'm kind of right. Oh shit. <laughs> Not quite. She said there was one final thing she had to take care of. I'm sure she'll be finished soon enough. She said that? In those words? She... did, yes. Clive. Were you born yesterday or something? There is no thing. She'll probably be halfway to Canva by now. Oh, mid. I might still be able to catch her. Oh, no. Mid, what the hell are you doing? Oh god, ah right, good, I need to talk to him anyway. I thought I had to be fast travel. Have you seen Mid? Yep. In a boat. Going that way. <sighs> then I'm too late. Oh, you in a hurry at all, are ya? Oh, I offered to take her across, but she wouldn't wait. Just paid for a dinghy and rode off. Oars going like the clappers. <laughs> Got some life in her, ain't she? But anyway, I was on my way up to see you, as it happens. Got a letter for you. Oh, no. Urgent, by the sound of it. One of your uncle's men said I was to hand it to you in person, post-bleeding haste. And you're here now. Thank you, Oberleth. Don't mention it. What tidings, uncle? Uh Actually you guys can read this as well. I'm just trying to read this to my to myself. Troubling Canva. Well, I'll need someone to keep an eye on Mid. So what? Mid got us to do all the dirty work and then just sailed off into the sunset? It, uh... seems that way. Well, nothing we can do about it now. But next time you plan on visiting Sid, you might want to tie her to something before you suggest it. Ah, oh, don't be so hard on her. Gotta admit, the dirty work was kind of fun. Everyone pitching in, all that bollocks. Just like when we built this place. <laughs> You're right. Anyway, we all set to head to the old hideaway. I could do with getting to Canva pretty sharpish. Wouldn't do to keep Lord Rosfield of the Seven High Houses waiting now, would it? <laughs> Not after he asked for me personally. Gav will be leaving with me. Will you mind the place while we're gone? You can count on me. Just make Thanks. sure give Sid and the others my regards. Right. <sighs> oh, by the way, Jill will be joining us too. She's got some things to take care of, but she'll meet us there. Okay. I hope she's telling the truth at least. <sighs> I knew it. I... Why is there another side quest right there? Like, what the... Wait, you know what? You know what? That's fine. 
you know what? That's fine. I can work for it another time. I have a funny feeling it will be another hunt pod, but Sid's was Sid's legacy. <clears throat> See, it should it it should have right been me and mid and toggle, but I can't believe she went one off. Well, Sid, I remember what you told me. But if no one is listening to what you have to say, you may as well not say it. Say this, old friend. Hugo Kuka is gone. His shadow looms over us no longer. Mm. It's a pity the Phoenix can't be in two places at once. If he'd have been with us, maybe he could have done something for the lost. Not even the Phoenix can bring people back from the dead. I wish he could. And I'll be one Life set back. Has a beginning and an end. So we must live while we have the chance. And not as slaves to the crystals, but as free men. <coughs> well said. We join you. Aww. Karen, goats, yay! Lady Karen, what a pleasant surprise. I thought I'd drop by and see how you were all doing before heading off to restock my supplies. This is nice. Mid should be there, still. Regardless, Mid should be there. <sighs> it wasn't the most scenic view back then, but it was never as bad as this. I know. The blind march is on. And soon, there will be no escaping sights like these. So our mission remains unchanged. We cannot stop until every mother crystal is gone and their thirst for ether with them. The only one that remains in storm is Drake's tail in the crystalline dominion. Mm. Our next target. Yep. We're going to Twinside. It's the capital of the Empire these days. I wouldn't like to think how tightly guarded they've got the place. Not that that'll stop you, but we do well to scout it out before you go charging in. We would indeed. If you're off to the Dominion, you can take this great lump with you. <coughs> Goods. Oh, I am sorry. Have you forgotten you're the most wanted man in the Twins? I thought you might like to disguise yourselves as the attendants of a travelling trader, assuming you've no better ideas. <laughs> You wanted to buy yourself some tools, didn't you? Well, now's your chance. <laughs> You're letting me go with them. Oh, <laughs> Thanks, man. You break me bones, you great galoot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I, I will, um... There's a caravan that runs back and forth between the Dominion and the Boklab markets. It's managed by the Merchants Guild. Just show them Goots' traders pass and you'll be on your way. It'll be a damn sight less risky than footing it the length of the Crystal Road. That's for sure. Thank you, Karen. And glad to have you with us, Goots. Oh, oh, okay then. I'll get me things and I'll meet you there. 
<laughs> She's dragging her and then just went boop. <laughs> My poor man. Jill, you're with me. Understood. And Gav. Already on my way, Captain. Be careful. Aren't I always? Great, so now we are captain of a somewhat of a ship. We have uh, Goots gonna be there. Did you see that, Sid? Your protege is making a proper little outlaw of himself. He's gonna be meeting us there. We got Gav doing the scouting, and that's it. Oh, fuck. Okay. Well, now I need to keep an eye on Goots because I don't want to lose him because he's a big. He's just like a big bear. And of course, we can't really fucking. Back. Oh, actually, we can. We can. Um, just to be safe, I just want to make sure that I want to just go back and check because I am really annoyed the fact that there is another little point to this. Okay, why is it still telling me there's a fucking side quest point? Oh, the reading table. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh, God. Okay, fine. We'll have a good peek. <sighs> Damn it all. Wait, is it? Yeah, it's just straight up. He cracked my crystal too. Mother. Wait, let's get this done. Right, okay. I'm here. Where's the page oh <sighs> fine hopefully it's nothing but I should speak to Blackthorn just in case oh A another one with a bruise Right, you know what? We just get them all ticked, oh, and while we do is, I will. Shouldn't he be asking Otto for help? What I'll just do is, I will. Once we get to the main mission, I, because I want to get like, I want to like try and get like everything out the wood, and especially we got normal letters. Wait, I have like a bunch right here, but. <laughs> Or driven will be be leisure at all. Okay. What could be wrong with Togo? You seen well enough when I last saw him. <laughs> Fuck. Wait. Okay, okay, wait. So now we got we got wait one up there, two here. Yeah, you know what? We'll come back with him, right? We'll come back with him. Because normally I would like to get an, a, a little bit of progress into this and then we'll deal with everybody in the hideaway. I was a bit surprised about Togo, but we'll, we'll just try and break a little area in here and then we'll... <coughs> Onward, right. So, once we make it to the next town, how are you feeling? In this, then better. Thanks to Taya. I'm glad to hear it. And, and I, I too. keep forgetting Ooh, about the. I kind of kept forgotten about. Oh, check the notes, and then I forgot side quest, and I keep thinking back me. This used to so. be a trade route for merchants crossing the scars. Till the Republic laid a new road wide enough to let wagons pass, and all official traffic moved there. Oh, there's that. Uh, 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 living outside the law. That will, uh, Jake's fang. I doubt we'll be the only. We definitely will die. 
Oh boy. There's another fucking side quest, but, but you know what? We just do them all. Why not? Do the whole thing. So what do you think? Really? <coughs> it's as bad as that. <coughs> oh, why? There's trouble up ahead, and too much of it for us to handle. I take it there's danger on the road. Oh, what about this fearsome-looking fellow? You think he'd be equal to the task? Oh, no doubt. Assuming he's willing to hear us out. Go go on well, then. Met, friend. My brother and I have been tasked with finding a merchant's missing cart. You seen it by any chance? How does a merchant misplace his cart? Oh, the man's a coward. When he thought goblins might come a snarling, he ran. Leaving his livelihood abandoned in the pass. But he sent the two of us to fetch it, but it's gone. Now, I'm not much of a thinker. I know the work of thieves when I see it. My brother's right on all accounts. And by my estimation, the bastards are lying in wait just down the road. We may have seen our share of action, true, but we've not got the skill in arms to boldly brave an ambush. You, however, have the look of a man who needn't fear a band of backwater mm -hmm. ruffians. And we're never going to. Will you? Help us out. <sighs> Chances are they'll come for you either way. But if you promise to lend us a hand, at least you'll pocket a reward for your troubles. Well, if I'm going to, have to deal with them anyway, <laughs> you've clearly got a fine head on those broad shoulders. We're lucky you came along. Now, hoping to make a heavy purse in Bocklad. Our merchant friend loaded his cart with as much as it would carry. Reckon he won't be so we got a lot of work to do. We got like cat. We got stuff from Hideaway, and now we got this. So While this might help a lot. You keep your eyes open. All right. Just don't expect me to drag the cart out of there myself. No, no. Uh, you can leave the cart to us. You just put an end to those bandits and point us in the right direction. You do that. We'll take care of the rest. Hmm. I don't trust this. I don't trust this. I don't trust these two. Wait. So, where's the... Oh, the cart's just right in here. Okay. Really? You two are too lazy to deal with the... But if there are bandits lying in wait, I should probably take care of them. <laughs> you lot. Yes. These must be our bandits. <laughs> I'm a bit surprised at this. <laughs> no, I'm in the tornado. <laughs> Perfect way to end this first, end this episode.
that's them dealt with. Now, where's that cart? Um, let's end it. Actually, I'm gonna end it here because we are close to the car, and so what I'll do is I'll end it here and then make it easier from here. So, stay tuned, my friends. <laughs>